Hello everybody and welcome to Excel video 348. I just finished speaking to an MGMA group about how to use Excel, some tips and tricks in an anesthesia setting. If I haven't spoken to your group lately, I'd love to do something similar. We've played with array formulas and put formulas referencing cells, D2 to D22, E2 to E22. What I want to do today is start with constants and I'm just going to do a basic one and you're going to say, Nate, there's a way easier way to do this and I will grant you that all day long. But we're going to use an easy example that we can then leverage in future Excel videos once we know how to play with constants in an array formula. And by constants, I mean numbers, not a reference to C2 or whatever, but like the number six. Here's how to do it. Let's say I want to put the numbers one, two, three, four up here in cells A1 through D1. The formula is equals, and then the goofy thing here that you got to remember is you've actually got to enter those curly braces this time. When you're doing constants, you're going to enter those. So we're going to do 1, comma, 2, comma, 3, comma, 4. Do the curly brace thing again. And then I type the curly braces, and now I've still got to do Control Shift Enter to make the numbers appear. And I grant you all day long that I could have typed 1, 2, 3, 4 faster than that. But bear with me and I'll show you how we might use it in future Excel videos. The thing I wanted to show you is a couple of things. Number one, I, I have to type in this, this brace here and that brace. And I have to do control shift enter to get the outer braces to appear. And then I have commas to get me from column to column. If I want to do something like this, where I've got multiple rows, well, I can do that. What I'm going to do is do a formula that says equals Again, I'm going to type the brace, 1, 2, 3, 4, semicolon, 5, 6, 7, 8. Got to do the brace again, Control, Shift, Enter. And that semicolon, it's kind of like a carriage return. It kicked me down 1, 2, 3, 4 to the next row, 5, 6, 7, 8. And if I wanted to do something like this instead, well, let's just do a short one. I could do equals and 1, semicolon 2, semicolon 3, do the brace, control shift enter. That's how to enter constants, numbers, as opposed to formulas in arrays. There's a way to, that, uh, there's still, actually there are several ways to use constants in an array formula. Once you know how to do this, once you know how to enter the braces and control shift enter afterwards and the comma and the semicolon, all that good stuff, I'll show you an example of how you might use this in the next Excel video. Thanks for watching.